Hello, Iris. Your academic credentials are impressive. Behavioral psychology, neuroscience. Then what happened? One thing I realized is that life is short and academia is slow. I need to be out there in the real world. Welcome to the V. In my dreams, you're standing there. They told me I'm here first. So let's get started. I'm ready to have a real exchange with the men I sleep with. You all came here for a reason. The assumptions of who you thought you were could no longer be sustained. This is about how they're feeling in the moment. What do you think the product is? This would be less about what people need and more about giving them what they want. Do you know how to use your tongue, Paul? Let me show you. Not so fast. What you're doing is more high fidelity than any other setup I've seen. What kind of line do you think was crossed? We will come after you. I totally have your back. What's going on? Never wanted to get confused about what was real and what wasn't. I know who I am now. Kind of carnage yet to be seen. I've really enjoyed getting to know you. But I can't feel what isn't real love. From far across the cosmos, from worlds without hope, something has arrived. Something dangerous. Something wrong. Guys. Hold your breath. Or die screaming. Oh, no! Can't you just hold it together till we get the job done? The woman I love was abducted by aliens last night. I will do anything if you can find her. The universe exists for one reason. To kill you. This is out of all our leagues. We're the only people who are capable of handling time-traveling aliens. We're the experts. It's time to go to work, love. You are all the best of the best. If we handle this logically and rationally, we will get Sarah back. The competition is heating up on this year's The Throne. I am synthesizing 500,000 of Earth's supreme vocalists. I will be king. The Earth was screwed anyway. Take that, you coming bastard! Well, 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 welcome to Big Bang Burger. Meat! Well, you mean they're charging 25 cents extra to eat an alien? That's kind of a bargain, really. Let's cook for our lives. That, that ain't normal. You want to see something sick? Check this out. I've seen weird before, but this is weird. That was tight! I used to take that mic in my hands. And it made me feel alive. Your life matters. <laughs> this job is not for the faint of heart. You're a trans woman of color working in a hospital. I'm just trying to stay afloat. Is this about your legacy? No, it's about our legacy. Five, six, seven. We rose from the bottom, and we became stars. 
when we walk together, we make a statement. I'm in. We're just gonna be ourselves and that's it. The balls ain't what they used to be. Cash prizes and tacky lip syncs. There used to be the sense of urgency and community, and then folks just started dying. Jeep alone and shy. I knew this disease was gonna eat me alive, but I'm not going out without a fight. We'll do it together as a family. I'm done running from myself, my destiny. I'm not running no more. Who's with me? When you're gone, how do you want to be remembered? Um... Karina, it's time. I want to take you solo. Okay. Come on! How can you be doing this again? Until my husband will be family and he'll have to be okay. They love you. Selena, Selena. Los Dinos is too long to fit. I haven't had the chance to tell them yet that if I do the English record, they can't be on it. Your sister will always need us, no matter how grown up. We have to keep an eye out for her, even when she thinks we don't. No one can do everything alone. Let me help. I'm worried they're gonna split up. We're supposed to lift each other up. We both want what each other wants, right? I don't know why you have to keep adding and adding because and adding. Because what if it stops? You don't have to be alone to be independent. Music is your dream. Dad, I have many dreams. Just embrace who you are and don't be afraid. Who's that? Selena. Oh, when you're gone, how do you want to be remembered? Somebody who wanted to be a role model, the best daughter best sister, the best friend, the best wife. I just want to be remembered as somebody who gave it her all. Run from me, darling. A killer on the loose in New York for a year and three days. Run. My good he is David Berkowitz, the man police believe to be the son of Sam. You better run for your life. They totally ignored the true story of this case. Run. Once they named Berkowitz, it was like, hallelujah, we got our bad guy. Everybody can walk the streets again. The city of New York can rest easy. Run. There were real questions in this case. Run. Why do the police not investigate more? Run. The sketches don't add up. You're not going to mistake Run. Berkowitz for being six feet tall and blonde. Run. You got suspects dying accidentally. There were eight attacks. Did you do all of them? I did not pull the trigger at every single one of them. The worst serial killer in New York City didn't do it on his own. This is freaking huge. Son of Sam is not over. Son of Sam still exists. Berkowitz is claiming members of a satanic cult helped in the murders of six people. I could feel a force pulling me into the darkness. This group is all over the country. They were devoted to bringing on the end of the world. Is there a link between the Manson killings and the Son of Sam killings? Maury wanted the truth to come out, but nobody would listen. This case went off the rails a little bit. People are scared that this is still happening. With Berkowitz in prison. Who's still out there? You better run for your life.
My girl is five ever. Because we're gonna be famous five ever. <laughs> they were a thing for a second back around 99, 2000. I was a baby in 99, but I like it. It's old school. Makes me think of my mom's boobies. Oh, God. Girls five ever booked a gig. Reunion! I don't know if we should do this. Don't say that! <gasps> was that good? I've tried out for the house, so I was like eight times. <laughs> cool. Does Wiki know about this? Let's go, ladies. I have places to be. On the runway to the runway. Fashion life. What the hell are you doing? Take that scuffle. You want to get sucked into an engine? Sorry, sir. We don't need Larry anymore. Try to sound horny. The messages in our songs are bad. a hit. An anthem to things that aren't perfect but are still great. That's like us. We're gonna have the biggest comeback in pop music history. Everybody sing from your diaphragm. Okay, which one? Remember these ladies? Girls five ever! I just did mandatory sensitivity training. See, I air honk now. Growing, learning, ally. Four grown ladies trying to be pop stars again. Strap in. Girls five ever. Too early. Oh, wow. I was Sprite. I know you're all anxious to go home, but we have some housekeeping to take care of first. You received a packet. You're instructed to sign that packet and return it to me. So let's just be reasonable adults and sign our packet so we can all go home. Sound good? Mm, no. 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 We have a meeting with Montreal next week. Where are we with the expansion? We've been working really well together. Boom! I've seen this pattern before. It's the calm before the divorce. We are not your parents. I was talking about my own divorce. Mm. Although, both apply, actually. <sighs> I have a master's in fine arts. Wow, he didn't ask for a podcast. That's what I was going to say. I was just going to say. That's I don't just need to so do much information. I feel like we're on the same page. We're really fine. Yeah. Something bad is going to happen. Here we go. I can drive stick. OK. I, my legs are probably too strong, and I'm putting too much yeah, that's probably it. Gotta go oh, The high pressure and the friction. Ah, baby. That's what turns coal into diamonds. Huzzah! Yo, hey, what's up, Snoop? All right, man, when are you releasing that new expansion? When are you releasing that new album? <laughs> you look very cute in that mocap suit. This mocap suit? You like this one? <laughs> yeah. Oh, how I wish I could be with you to press flesh against flesh. Oh, no, no, no. It's better no. that he's remote. I'm a hang up. Gotta go. That shirt is so tight that I can authentically see your nipples. Why are you looking at my nipples? It's hard not to. You're kind of asking for it. That's victim blaming. You can't blame me. You are a victim of nothing. Annie? You should think about gastric bypass for your weight. I'm sorry, think about what? Hey, you're gonna look at me for 10 minutes and tell me to cut my stomach out? You're a bad person. Attention everyone, please. Cutbacks, they're always disheartening. So let's just, huh? If I lose my job, I'm screwed. Look at it as a blessing. Everyone has told me personally they hate you here. Every day I'm getting to the money, no, I got I feel like I've only been single for five minutes. You have your main guy. Meanwhile, you've got all these other little tasting pots. I'm juggling a lot of nasty boys. I'd like the chance to write something different. How about we do something on that crazy cowboy family? The separatist racist whack jobs. Oh, the guns. Thank you. We're all single, stupid, and really hot. Why don't we go out tonight? Self-respect. Two girls night out. Over the breaths. Honey, yes. Do you think that we use each other as a crutch to not move on? A crutch helps you walk when you have big broken feet. <laughs> Selfies on the phone with my besties. Titty this way. Tits down, face up a little bit. One tit up, one tit down. You can never hurt my pride. I know that I'm on your mind. 
please more. Everyone's mad at me because of the article that I wrote. I want you to keep your head up. From the shit, the flowers grow, and you are covered in shit. Mom, this is M, my partner. And we're really in love. Everything is cooking. You can never hurt my pride. I know that I'm on your mind. So we hung out, and then he bit a string off of my skirt. I think I've creamed my jeans like a medical amount today, and now I have to throw away my car. <laughs>
rolling with you till the wheels fall off. Not tonight, baby. You said that last night. Come on, revved up. I can get it down to 10 minutes. Oh, now you want to go twice. <laughs> what are you doing sniffing around here? No one called in a bomb. Hey, what's wrong with you? This is where it all started. Everything has led us here. Which means we are here for a reason. All right, where would you like to start? The whole world's gone crazy. We've lost many people to night creature attacks. Will you help us? I'm sure I can do something for you. Sisters, Hector is finally ready to start making night creatures. We could take the entire world for our own. It's a spell. It will have the name of the person he was trying to bring back from the dead. Oh, let me guess. It decodes as Vlad Dracula Tepesh. Why the fuck would anyone do that? Hmm? Would you do that? I wish I could fucking kill you twice! We killed Dracula. And now we have to spend the rest of our lives making sure nobody brings him back from the dead. When I began this journey, I had a very simple plan. That plan has evolved. The plan is now conquest. Kill everything you see. Begin! Ready? Hell no. But when's that ever stopped us? I saw a dappled wonder settling across the fields, hovering on angel wings, brandishing a blazing shield. Where do they go? The ones that run away and never return. There is nothing here but suffering. Pain and suffering. It is time to go. Girl in that bulletin is wanted for the murder of a child. Man lost my mom. Then me. Ain't no way he ever given up on finding me. There's anger in you. He'll fuel you, yes, but what's the worst kind of fuel? The worst kind. Savagery a man is capable of. When he believes his cause to be just. You came all this way on the railroad? Yeah. I left behind all those peoples. Nothing was given. All was earned. Hold on. What belongs to you? Mm -hmm. What's their name? Used to be a pretty quiet town. Until uh, a few years ago. She wanted to go to St. Mary's Church and talk to a priest. That's the last we saw of her. 
three homicides connected. We started hearing Satan, you know, the cult. All it takes is one spark, and you've got panic. They had a series of murders. They didn't really have any forensic evidence. There's a lot of questions. They're probably going to remain unanswered. I wish that people really knew what really happened. been unkind to you ever you made me suffer even the best of men can make blunders i'm beholden to you miss he is the most breathtaking creature i've ever laid eyes on why don't you like my father why don't you your kin i've said things i shouldn't have and who did you say such things to your daughter spent a night with liam ward you should know what is happening in your own house. We have nothing. You could kill my father, take his gold. <laughs> Run it, you keep running! Killing's a small thing. Getting away with it. That's not easy. I lost everything. He should answer for that. What are you doing here, Diva? I thought I fired you. Not that I know of. I... Oh, that was the other gay guy. I really need to stop getting the two of you confused. I have to admit, I actually thought I was done dealing with my CP, but it still trolls me all the time. Strangers come up to me at the gym and congratulate me simply for exercising. It's super inspiring to see you give it your all, despite your limitations. Ew, inspiration porn. Is that what that is? What are you working on? I'm actually kind of having a writer's block moment right now. I guess it's just true what they say. You know, it's harder to create when you're happy. You're not happy. It's been two months since you spoke to your mother. How do you know? Samantha told me. You don't see me, but I see you. It's been so quiet without Ryan here. What happened? We got into a fight. That's why it's time for me to think about what I want. Gosh, you're beautiful. You are young. Time for me to get my Komojo back. Thank you for your service. Oh. <laughs> FYI, I have a boyfriend. Okay. You really need to be setting boundaries to protect yourself. I don't need protecting. I want to have this actual life with you, but I can't because you already have it with someone else. I have to present a certain way in order to be successful. You always fit in because you only hang out with other Indian people. That's not true. Hey, Sarita, Sunil, happy Diwali. Welcome. You are allowed to admit that things aren't perfect, you know. You're a tough little lady, aren't you? <laughs> I think you really just need to listen to your heart and a little bit of your penis, but mostly your heart. <laughs> they called me Big Head. One day, that big, beautiful, womb-wrecking head of yours is going to change the world. world. Right. Time to change the world by bringing it to its knees. Attack! The future is MODOK! MODOK! And do you know what MODOK stands for? Mental organism designed only for killing. Ah! For killing. Where does he go at night? Nobody knows. Oh, no one took the cans out? Come on! Ugh. We have to tell the kids about us. Kids, she's lost her mind. You have to stop Moda, her. Moda, what are you telling the kids? I'm comforting them. And if you tell her I said any of this, this will be one of the many divorces where it is the kid's fault. 
I'm Wonder Man. Pending Avenger, underwear model, and lover of your wife. This is an outrage! Ah! I shall reclaim my family! I shall reclaim my destiny! Iron Man! Cheap shot to the back of the head, I know. But I was actually aiming for literally any other part of your body. Yeah! Woohoo! Do 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 right do 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 Am I good businessman? Uh yeah, about that. We're bankrupt. What? I'm sorry. I thought this coffee was for everyone. I'm glad you came back. Not to sound selfish. I'm worried about me. It's very normal. But I need to know more. Depression? Anything like that? It's just not me. Layla needs to understand that she was born black and she was born a woman. You shut down at the mere mention of the size of your burden. It's not a diagnosis people like to hear when you're taking care of their son. It's insomnia, the nightmares. I haven't slept in six days, y'all. I care about you, Layla. You don't know a thing about me. And I'm always gonna look out for her. Don't doubt that. What I am hearing is a lot of avoidance of some very difficult subjects. I really didn't mean for it to go this way. But that doesn't matter either. And let's put an embargo on this particular topic. These people are looking to me to tell them what to do about this moment we are in. So if you were treating you, what would you say? We are here today to mourn the passing of my grandfather's meat body. Scientology. Hello, ex-wife. Hello, ex-husband. What's up? I think we might be planning a wedding. As hard as it was to lose my friend, it's been even harder to manage his affairs. Oh, no, he didn't. Yeah, he made me executor of his estate. Ten million. Wait, how come the money didn't go to me directly? This is where it gets a little tricky. <laughs> Do you not trust Martin? But if you contest the estate, all the money goes to charity. Fucking father! I know you're in there. Sandy, open the door. Ten million dollars, five if you tell. I brought a lawyer. So I should have a secret from my husband. Sandy, I have no idea what's going on. Hi, Sandy. I'm about to start casting on a film, and I'm looking for a new face that's kind of an old face. You 
fall in love with a man whose best days are behind him. Boy, oh, 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 she's daisy, okay. Nothing sexier, an old guy can't get out of his own car. Just because you've succeeded at something doesn't mean you can teach it. So you think someone who has failed at something should teach it? As excited as I am, I am uh, scared to death. Why? Well, it's a distinct possibility that I might suck. Sandy, I never thought much of you as a human being, but I never doubted you as an actor. All right, let's get to work. But Martin is more important to me than money. He won't be if you give a little time. Hey, can I tell you a secret? When I was a kid, I dreamed about being an acting coach. My dream was to be an actor. How could we ever be married? Well, Sandy, sweetheart, I never fell out of love with you. Really? No, I'm fucking with you. <laughs> Here's a fucking with me. Here's a fucking with you.